$26.6 billion nationwide and $1.4 billion in Alabama alone. These numbers represent the revenue generated from the deer hunting industry in just one year. It's pretty astounding. Now I study whitetail deer. For a minute, let's think about the deer hunting industry, not as a hunting industry, but as an actual company. And let's call it something creative like Deer Co. Well, if Deer Co at $26.6 billion was a company, it would rank number 112 on the current Fortune 500 list of US corporations, directly behind McDonald's. Now, if Deer Co were a real corporation, it's daunting to imagine how much work would go into managing it. There would be countless business analysts poring over all kinds of fancy metrics, performance indicators, and trying to craft recommendations to CEOs so that they can best determine what to do for the future of the company. Unfortunately, in wildlife, things aren't quite this elegant. There are three major issues with deer management. One, resources are extremely limited. In Alabama, the state only has about $2 million to manage deer per year, which is less than 1% of what the deer industry is worth. Number two, collecting deer metrics is extremely difficult and expensive. It's really hard just to determine the number of deer in an area, and it takes a lot of money and a lot of man hours. Number three, even with good deer's metric, it's not easy to determine what to do. You have a lot of different stakeholders involved. You have farmers who are concerned about deer eating their crops. You have hunters that are interested in seeing more bucks. And then you also have people who are concerned with invasive species like coyotes and their predation on fawns. As you can see with all these different stakeholder viewpoints, it's really difficult to determine the best thing to do. Now this is where my research comes in. My research aims to streamline deer management. I'm using new techniques for accurately estimating deer numbers. I'm identifying the key deer metrics needed to improve management. That way managers can get the biggest bang for their buck. And I'm also working to develop a plan and a set of guidelines to use, to use these deer metrics to help managers decide what to do based on their goals for management. To do this, I'm working with Alabama's Department of Conservation and Natural Resources at 16 different WMAs across the state of Alabama. Eventually, my, resource, my results will be directly applied to deer management within the state of Alabama and hopefully serve as a framework to help monitor and manage this multi-billion dollar industry across the country. Thank you.